Hey, Bolo Buddies, thanks for watching. Okay, you guys, I have a Lisa Frank Bolo category video for you guys. Oh my goodness, you guys, Lisa Frank is a Bolo, and I'm going to share with you some big money Bolo items to be on the lookout for. But before we get started, I want to share with you guys a few things. Um, the first item I want to talk to you guys about is my new channel. Well, it's not really new anymore, but Sourcing with Bolo Buddies. I'm up to 1.2K subscribers. So if you guys are not subscribed, definitely go over there and subscribe. Um, I just released a new video and it is an estate sale box. My husband went to an estate sale and there was this box of stuff. I think it's kind of like at the end of the estate sale where they kind of cleaned off the table and they looked at my husband and they're like, do you want it all for 10? And he just kind of stood there and didn't really say anything. And they're like, how about five? And he's like, okay. So he took this box of stuff for five and he was like sitting outside. We have this little bench and he was looking through this box of stuff. And I walked out and I'm like, Hey, what are you doing? He's like, I got all this stuff for five bucks. And I'm like, what? And I'm like, can I do a video on that? So I called up my friend Carissa and she just started a channel chosen goods reseller. And I'm like, Hey, will you do an unboxing with me? So, um, this is Carissa's channel. So definitely go check out Chosen Goods Reseller and give her a sub. Show her some love with a sub, you guys. Chosen Goods Reseller. And um, check out this video because I don't know. Let me know what you guys think. If you think he got some good stuff, I think he will definitely make some money. But that video is doing really, really well. I think there's some money that he can definitely make. I also have a new video on List Perfectly. You guys know that I love List Perfectly. If you want to try List Perfectly, you can get 30% off your first month with referral coupon code Bolo Buddies, all one word. And a subscriber sent me a mystery box. Oh my goodness, so fun. I listed everything in the box. I show you how I listed it. Um, I also went to this crazy estate sale that had all of this McDonald's vintage stuff. That's right here. So lots of good stuff over on this channel. I'm doing some new stuff over here. It's a lot of sourcing, but good, good fun. So definitely go check out that channel. And as you guys know, I do have memberships on my main channel. And I want to feature um, as a little bonus perk. Um, I do have the main um, thing that I'm doing where I do the video with um, all of the members. but I want to do a shout out to Mindful Recycle. She is awesome. She has a great channel. She does not have enough subs. I'm telling you, she is a bolo finder. We have a similar um, style of the things that we source and list. So definitely go over and check out what she's selling. I think you guys will really like her channel. She's at 180 subscribers. Um, her recent video, 800,000 percent profit on these bolos. I haven't watched it yet. I just saw the thumbnail. So um, definitely got to check that out. But uh, definitely go watch it. Tell her in the comments that Bolo Buddy sent you. Definitely give her a sub. And uh, here, here it is. Here it is. Okay. Be on the lookout. So these people right here, people, these resellers, we'll call them resellers, are members of um, members of my Bolo Buddies YouTube channel. And the perk that they get is they are featured in a monthly video and I show you guys their Bolo. So I go into their store and I dig out their Bolos, their big money Bolos, and I share them with you guys in a video. And I'm telling you, this video is packed with Bolo items that I didn't know about. So it is awesome. So go check out this video right now here. And I have their um, channels linked down in the description. So you want to definitely follow them because they are Bolo finders and you are going to learn a lot from them. Okay. Are you guys ready for some Lisa Frank? I know you're ready for some Lisa Frank. Let's get into it. All right. The first one. And I did go in and check to make sure this was a sale that went through. And I'll show you guys how to do that. So this is a Lisa Frank Casey dog cookie jar. Check it out. It's a cookie jar. And they only have three photos. So um, 
I would have liked to have seen like what the bottom looked like. I would have liked to have seen the box. Um, I don't know if I was going to, uh, let's see, 96, 907 feedback. Let's see here. All right, I'm gonna show you guys how to go in. So if you go right here and you click on this and you go right here, you can see I absolutely love my item. It was packaged well and shipped fast. I wouldn't recommend seller, or I would recommend seller and easily do business again, $999. So they got positive feedback and everything went well. The next item are these pencils on this green shag carpet. Nothing like pencils on the green vintage shag carpet. Check out these pencils. How cool is that? With the original 77 cent price tag sticker. Awesome. Awesome. Okay, these sold for $125 with 42 bids. And I did go in and verify that this was a good sale with feedback the next item is this vintage lisa frank that sold for 162 dollars and i just got a cha-ching let's see what i sold here what did i sell oh i didn't sell anything my husband sold a watch okay vintage lisa frank turtle peekaboo mushroom clear backpack and this sold for 162.50 and i think this one might have been i feel like this one was in my facebook group like somebody shared it over there but um i did not go in and verify this one but most of these i did verify i feel like i remembered this one so i didn't check it the next item are these lot of three lisa frank bean buddies ballerina bunnies all right, how cute are those? Super cute. All right. And then this Lisa Frank Vintage Turtle Peekaboo Mushrooms Lunchbox Sack Insulated Bag sold for $197.50 with 41 bids. Stuff you love, Lisa Frank. Okay, and from what I was told, I believe it was Jessie Shops. And if you guys aren't following her, definitely go over and show her some love with a sub. Uh, Jessie Shops recently started her YouTube channel, and she is adorable. She wears all of these super cute vintage clothing items, and she goes into the thrift stores, and she, like, models them and does twirls. She's super cute. And she makes really adorable jewelry. But she said that Lisa Frank, how to know it's vintage is that the Lisa Frank, the L and the F are capitalized. And I think somebody else told me that after her also. So um, I think two people have told me that, but I can't remember who the second person was. But this one sold for $197.50. The next item is this vintage 80s, 90s Lisa Frank piano music rainbow note spiral line paper notebooks sold for $200 with free shipping. And I did go in and check that one and it did have feedback. So very cool. The next item is this rare vintage trapper keeper with the butterflies and the flowers sold for $72. Um, that was an auction with 28 bids plus shipping. Trapper keepers, um, are a good bolo, these old um, style trapper keepers. Even if they are not Lisa Frank, look them up because a lot of those style trapper keepers can be a bolo. The next item is this vintage Lisa Frank um, Fabulous Fruit Girls. Uh, this looks like it's an unpunched folder, paper, and stickers. So unpunched, I'm guessing um, like the folder, you know how it has the three circles that go, um, that the ring, the rings go through, I'm guessing those are unpunched. I'm guessing that's what that means. So that one went for $79 plus shipping. The next item is this cheerleader bears. Again, it's an unpunched folder. Yep, unpunched, sold for $110 and the buyer paid shipping. 
This one sold for $710 and it's a Lisa Frank Zoomer and Zorbit duffel bag. And you guys are saying, yeah, right. That didn't get paid for. Look at it. It's not even in good condition, you guys. It's got a rip. No way somebody paid $710 for that. No way. No way. Yes way. Right here. Exactly as described, fast shipper, $710. There it is, you guys. It sold. It was paid for. They left positive feedback. Yep. Bolo, very rare vintage Lisa Frank cheetah print smiley face girls rule day planner, $177.50. I will tell you that I sold one of these day planners. Um, mine was a smiley face print but mine was um, more of the uh, nylon. I Oh, is it nylon? Oh, I don't know if it was nylon. I don't know what the material was, but more of the plasticky material. And it was more of the neon colors, but I, I can't remember what it sold for. It's in one of my past videos, but I picked mine up at a garage sale, I think for a quarter and it sold for over $100. And then I recently sold the one that was in a video. It's on one of my thumbnails on my sourcing with Bolo Buddies channel. And um, I'm actually holding it up in the thumbnail. And I think it sold for 60 or 70. So definitely a Bolo. But this one sold with 35 bids for uh, $177.50 plus shipping. The next item that sold is this rare vintage Lisa Frank storage bin with handles. It sold for $157.50 plus shipping. I did verify the last, this one and the one before with the feedback. This vintage Lisa Frank sticker box, I think I verified this one also. Um, I was trying to verify most of them uh, just to keep it kind of legit when I'm doing these category videos because I know so many times people don't pay. But I also know oftentimes people do not leave feedback. Um, I'm guilty of not leaving feedback. <sighs> I know that's horrible to admit as a reseller. I should be better about that. But a lot of times I just forget. But this sold for $305 plus shipping. The next item, I did verify this one. It's a vintage rare. It's just a little storage case, a small storage case. I don't know if it like holds. Yeah, band-aids. And this is not a big money bolo, but it sold for $31, which is pretty fantastic for a little Band-Aid case. Um, it had 18 bids and the buyer paid shipping. The next item that sold is this towel, this beach towel. It sold for $181.89 with 13 bids and the buyer paid shipping. And I did go in and verify that one. This clock, I did verify. It sold for $57 and the buyer... Uh, the shipping was free on that one. And it's just a clock that you put a battery in the back and it's plastic. So nothing super fancy. So $57 is pretty, pretty great, right? Now, this one is mind blowing, you guys. Mind blowing Bolo. That's what you have right here. This is a vintage 1980s Lisa Frank sticker. Giant foiled ballet slipper shoes, teddy bears. I have no idea why this went for $248.54. I would not believe it if I didn't verify it. <laughs> but it's a Sandy Lion sticker. And I know that Sandy Lion stickers are collectible. But this is a Lisa Frank. Well, it says Lisa Frank. But how do you know it's Lisa, Lisa Frank? Okay, hold on. I'm trying to figure this out. I see Sandy Lion. Do you guys see? Where does it say Lisa Frank? Does anybody know? Super giant stickers. I'm looking here. I'm really confused. Does it say it on the front? Hmm. I'm really confused. 1980s Lisa Frank. Maybe that's why it's so special is because you don't know. But I went here and it says, awesome seller, always kind and quick to ship. Thank you. And right here it is, 1980s sticker, giant foil ballet slipper shoes, teddy bears, 
So I verified that it did sell, but I don't know how they know it's Lisa Frank. So maybe it's just one of those where the seller knows and that's why it's more valuable. If anybody knows, let me know. And I wonder how big it actually is. You can see the reflection of her hand. Let's see. A wonderful vintage 1980s Lisa Frank sticker foiled pink ballet slippers. It measures seven inches by nine and a half, never used and straight out of my own personal childhood sticker collection. Please look carefully at the front and back photos provided for details, any possible flaws, marks, rough edges, etc. If you plan to use these, they could need additional adhesive, couple of edge tears, edge crinkles to backing. Tiny tear at top bear's arm. I'm happy to combine shipping. Wow. So it's a pretty big sticker, seven inches by nine and a half. But my word, $248, you guys. Wow. And there it is. Okay, this one is a Lisa Frank Dream Rider stationery. And you guys, vintage stationery can be a bolo. So certain ones, some of the old Hallmark can be a bolo also. So definitely look that up. But this one sold for $77 plus shipping. This one sold for $74.99 plus shipping. And this one has the kitty cats. This one had the dragon. And I really think with Lisa Frank, people just love Lisa Frank. This one has a Pegasus, which is a unic or a horse or a unicorn that flies, $78. This is a Lisa Frank sticker lot that sold for $107.50. I verified all of those. They are actual solds with feedback. And this is a Lisa Frank Zoomer and Zorbit puffy keychain that sold for $105.50. And that one was verified also. So definitely, definitely, definitely be on the lookout for Vintage Lisa Frank. Again, capital L, capital F shows that it's vintage. These items are retired, hard to find. And there are hardcore Lisa Frank collectors out there that will pay up for these items. Now, are all items that are Vintage Lisa Frank highly collectible and sought after? they definitely range. So definitely look them up before you pay crazy money for something. But a lot of them are sought after. So um, is auction style the way to go? Not necessarily. Um, you may want to just do a buy it now or best offer. But if it's something that you can't find another one like it, start the auction at $99.99 and let it ride. See what happens. And if it doesn't sell, then do a buy it now or best offer and start it high. I mean, it doesn't hurt to start your auctions high. That's acceptable. Just because you do an auction on eBay doesn't mean you have to start that auction at 99 cents. You can do whatever you want. So um, definitely be on the lookout for Lisa Frank. Thanks for being here. Thanks for watching. I have tons of Bolo category videos on my Bolo Buddies channel. I don't know if I'm going to put this on my Bolo Buddies channel or my sourcing with Bolo Buddies channel. So be sure to subscribe to both. Um, I am doing category videos on both channels. So thanks for watching. Be sure to subscribe, subscribe to both and I'll see you at the next one. Thanks for watching.